Julius Malema is a controversial South African political and leader of the Economic Freedom Fighters Party. He has been a vocal advocate for the right of South Africans, particularly those who have been historically marginalized. Malema has spoken out against what he sees as continued economic and social inequality in South Africa, particularly with regards to access to land and resources. He has also been a critical of the ruling African National Congress ANC party, accusing them of failing to, live, to deliver on the promises of the, of the liberation struggles. Malema's view on freedom in South Africa a complex. While he is a strong advocate for the right of South Africans, he has also been accused of promoting a radical and divisive agenda. In general, Julius Malema believed that true freedom in South Africa can only be achieved through a radical redistribution of wealth and resources. He called for the nationalization of the key industry, including mines and banks, and for the expansion expropriation of land without compensation. While these views are cont controversial and have drawn criticism from many quarters, Malema and the EFF continue to be a major force in South African politicals, particularly among young people and those who feel left behind by the current economic system. The freedom of South Africa has been a complex and multi-manifested historic. The country gained independence from lifting colonial rule in 1910, but apartheid, a system of institutionalized racial segregation and discrimination, was introduced by the white minority government in 1948 and remained in the press until the early 1990s. During this time, the black minorities were named based human rights, including the right to vote and the right to own property and the right to move freely within the country. Activists include Nelson Mandela and other members of the National Congress. African National Congress led a movement to overthrow apartheid and establish a new democratic government. After decades of struggles, South Africa had its first democratic election in 1994, with the ANC winning a landslide victory. This made the end of the apartheid and the beginning of a new era of freedom and democratic democracy for South Africa. Since then, the country had made significant progress in terms of human rights, including the right to vote, the right to freedom of expression, and the right to equality. However, South Africa still faces significant challenges in addressing the lack of apathy, including ongoing economic inequality, poverty, and social division. Many South Africans continue to advocate for greater freedom and equality, including the right to access basic services such as education, healthcare, and housing. The country's constitution guarantees many of these right but this, there is still much work to be done to ensure that all South Africans are able to fully enjoy the benefit of freedom and democracy. Thanks for watching.